Hey guys, so today I am sitting on the floor, yes, and my bed looks so crazy just because it doesn't have a bed frame yet, um, and I have a kitchen table as my desk chair. Don't even worry about it, my apartment has not been put together yet. I am getting ready, so I just thought I would get ready and talk to you guys. I don't know why, um, I've never done one of these, I don't think, but... I don't know, I've actually been seeing them a bunch right now. I don't know why. Let's get started. I am not a makeup pro. I literally know nothing about makeup. But I just got a new foundation. It's Anastasia's like new foundation stick. And I got it in cool beige foundation stick. The um, Sephora at the Grove was literally horrible. Um, did not help me at all. So thanks Sephora at the Grove, you're the worst. I don't know if I'm doing it right. I don't know if this is not how you're supposed to do it. But what are you going to do, you know? Everyone is like freaking out on YouTube over um, trash. Tana Mojo's collab channel. Obviously, everybody knows. Um, but everyone has been making videos about that and about... Um, What's that girl's name? Shoot, I can't remember her name. But she talked about like transgender stuff and like, well not even transgender, she talked about asexual stuff. And now everyone on the internet's freaking out over those two things and everyone's saying that Tana's channel is promoting like self-hate and all that. Um, and then that the agender stuff like because they they did like this two genders thing um and she already apologized well one of the girls did so i feel like it's nothing to even get crazy over because everyone makes mistakes and she apologized for it and she like made a whole video talking about it so i feel like she shouldn't there shouldn't be any more videos on it but you know people are crazy with tana's thing i think like Everybody knows that those girls and like and there's boys on there too, but that they're all they were all like kind of doing what Tana was doing like that that was what they were doing, and obviously Tana doesn't hate herself and they don't hate themselves, but I mean maybe they do I don't know, but it's it just seemed like it just seemed like they were just doing that because that's like the trendy thing to do like I don't think they're actually promoting that or making anyone think that that's like how you need to act I don't know I also can't find my tweezers. So my cousin and I are going to the soccer game and we're going to lunch. And I love when my cousin's here. She, okay, this is kind of like personal stuff, but since we're doing a get ready together, let's just talk about all the personal things. I was definitely in a really deep depression for the last year and not a lot of people could see it, but I didn't want to go out like, I didn't want to hang out with people. I cut out like so many people in my life um, that I don't talk to now and I don't know if I want to talk to them. I don't know because I I don't want to explain this to them you know, even though I'm explaining it to the internet. But I want to explain like hey I cut you out of my life because I was depressed and I didn't want to talk to anyone. I came out of it like dead. Like literally I didn't talk to anyone on the weekends I would stay home or I would go to like one of my friends houses which um, she didn't even know that that's what I was going through I didn't even want to go to work but you know a girl's got to do what a girl's got to do so after my cousin got here like things kind of turned around and she like brought me out of the house and like made me talk to people again and and just like be okay like being around people I really appreciate my cousin because when she got here, she was like, I want to hang out. I want to hang out with people. Like, she's very, very outgoing. And she brought me out of that, like, state where I just didn't want to be around anyone or do anything. And I would just stay home all day and do nothing. So, oh, I remember how I was saying that I was at Sephora. And I got my foundation. I was trying to find an eyebrow pencil. I was trying to find this one, the Sephora one. Because it's $12 and it does the same shit. Um... And this one is like $21, and I don't know. Um, but I was trying to find that one, and no one was helping me. And 
then finally someone came and like looked in the drawer for me and then she was like oh let me see if we have any in the back I'll come right back so I'm like sitting here or not sitting here but I'm like sitting there or standing there waiting and waiting for like literally 20 minutes and I like started wandering around because I was like uh, this is taking way too long she I saw her pa like walk past me so many times and I'm like seriously so that's for really really sucks honestly like I get it they're busy but I don't know if you say you're gonna help someone and you say you're gonna come back and let them know if you have something maybe you should do that and I worked in retail so I know sometimes you take a second that's why I was patient but you don't just forget about someone my nose is running. Obviously, I talk to a camera all the time, but normally it's like about a topic, so I don't, it's not really like a conversation, it's just me talking, um, or like doing a skit or something, and like, this is like, I really feel like I'm having a conversation with myself, which makes me feel a little bit crazy. So, um, my friend was using my camera, and I think she like messed with the settings, so it's just like, kind of wacky. I need to look at it. So, in a previous video, I was talking about how um, how do you get big on YouTube and like, like what I think it is that you have to like do, I don't know, you know, to be big on YouTube. And then I talked to my friend Wheezy, who I always talk to about YouTube stuff because she is a homie and I love her so much because she always like has good things to say. Um, but she's just a good friend and... She was like, just do you still. Like, don't worry about it. Because I always get discouraged. I'm like, are people even liking these videos? My numbers look like from the outside perspective that they're going down. But because I'm posting more videos, they're actually going up. I don't know if that makes sense. So, I mean, it does. It's very clear. But basically on the back end, like where I see like my analytics and stuff, my views are going up, my subscribers are going up, everything's going up. But when I look at my channel page, like, the numbers are smaller than what they used to be. So, except for, like, obviously the subscriber count. But, like, the numbers for, like, views and stuff like that are smaller than, like, if I just posted one video, like, every few weeks. Like, then those ones are bigger. I don't know if that makes sense. So, um, so I was just, like, getting myself discouraged because when I look at... I don't want to think, look at numbers, but at the end of the day, we do, and that's what bothers us, and whatever. So, you guys know I moved and such, that's why my room looks like this, and it's not done. Um, but, I moved, and, um, and the grocery store here, like, I get it, everything around here must be more expensive, because, like, obviously I moved to a nicer place. But, I swear to God, the grocery store is more expensive, because, like, I buy the same things all the time, like, I don't know how to cook, like, I buy, like, the same like frozen vegetables and the same freaking applesauce you know what I mean like I don't really buy anything more than what I normally do and for some reason my groceries always come out to be really really expensive here I normally don't do eyeliner just because I bought the wrong freaking eyeliner um because I was just like rushing I was at the grocery store or something like random and I needed an eyeliner um, so I was like, oh, I'll just buy this one, and I thought it was the one that I used to get, um, when I was in high school, the Revlon Color Stay, and, like, it totally looks like it, it looks like it's the same one, but then the tip of it, oh, you guys can't see, the tip of it, see that? You guys probably can't even see it, but it's like, it's not a point, it's like a square, I'm like, what kind of freaking eyeliner is this okay I'm gonna put on more mascara in a second but I'm gonna say bye to you guys because the light is blinking and driving me crazy so if you guys like this video give it a thumbs up don't forget to subscribe down below because I make videos a lot this past week I haven't because I've been sick but I'm getting back in the game like I've been I've been pretty good the past few weeks and I also upload every Sunday so I'll see you guys in my next video bye yeah I think I got one her soul is presidential like Barack, son Yeah, she call me Goose, I call her Maverick cause a Top Gun They say we annoying, they just jealous cause we got love Ah, yeah